VidIQ is a powerful YouTube marketing platform. Now, if you want to get more views and make more money on your YouTube channel as a beginner, VidIQ Chrome extension can help. Why? Because it has a lot of tools that can help you with audience growth, YouTube SEO, competitor research, and overall channel management. So now, most YouTube beginners start with their phones and VidIQ's Chrome extension don't work on phones. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to install VidIQ's Chrome extension on your phone and you can start making the best out of your YouTube channel. So if you are a beginner on YouTube and you want to learn how to do this, stick right to the end of this video, watch every step and understand how you can do it because VidIQ's Chrome extension is surely going to help you in your YouTube journey. My name is Wado Mark and this is Max Scrib. Now, as I said earlier, a lot of new YouTubers or lots of new content creators on YouTube start out with their phones. And most of them don't even know what VidIQ is or what the YouTube marketing platform is like VidIQ. And not, most of them don't even know how to use it, the benefits and all. So that's why I made this video for you guys to tell you what VidIQ is and how you can start making use of it and start making the best out of your YouTube channel, all right? So there are lots of other YouTube marketing platforms like TubeBuddy, but I, I stuck with VidIQ because VidIQ is very user-friendly. Now, as I said earlier, it has tools that can help you with audience growth, competitor research, which is very, very important, channel management, and YouTube SEO. All right, so um, tools that can help you to get keywords for your YouTube channel, tools that can help you to actually see your monetization stage, like if you have actually reached the, the um, threshold for monetization, and lots of other tools that even I myself have not started using it. Now there's a pro version and there's a free version. The free version has limited access to the full potential of what VidIQ can offer and I still use the link the free version because it is actually very very good yet. So maybe at a point I can upgrade to the pro version but if you know you have the money to upgrade to the pro version and you want to start making the best out of your YouTube channel, you can sign up on VidIQ and buy the pro version. So the downside about this is that it only works on laptop and desktop computer devices. Most YouTubers that started with their phones won't have access to this. So I'm going to show you how to install this on your phone as you can see on the thumbnail and how you can start using it the same way people using on their laptop are going to experience it, alright? If this is the first time of using my face right here on YouTube, smash that subscribe button, hit the like button, share this video with your friends and drop comments in the comment section so that other people that need video like this other YouTube content creators that need video like this are going to see it and they can start making the best out of their YouTube channel as you are going to do. So let's head on to my phone screen. Let's go. All right, so right here on my phone screen, the first thing that you have to do is to head over to the search bar like on Chrome to the search bar and type in vidIQ and then click on search. So you are going to see options like this. This was two bodies that I was talking about and right here is vidIQ so we want to get our account created that's for people that don't know about um, vidIQ so you can get your account created i'm going to walk you through how you can install it and i'm going to show you some extra features in vidIQ and how you can start using them to make the best from your youtube channel so just click on vidIQ here or you can click on sign up for free so this was the chrome extension that i'm talking about and i'm going to show you how to install it so let's just head over to the vidIQ and let's see how it looks so right now you can see it is designed to boost your YouTube views. It says get free insights and guidance to keep your YouTube channel growing. VidIQ. Alright, so you can sign in, sign in, sign up with your Google account or with your email address. So I won't be signing up because I already have an account already. So if you say sign in, sign in with your Google account, it's going to take you to a, a new place where you are going to select your Google account. So select any one of your Google account and you can just sign up that's it so I'll be logging in into my own so that was the procedure on how to sign up so just click on the account or you can use your email and sign up straight there's no I'm so they set your password and that's it so the main thing is when it goes inside the app so how do we download vidIQ's Chrome extension on our phone because it's not going to work on Google Chrome so yeah, just head over to Play Store if you're using an iPhone, if you don't have an Android option at all, like if you don't have an Android option at all, the thing that you're going to do is to try to download it. I think Yandex browser is on the iPhone, but 
for for android what you are going to do is to come to the search bar and type in kiwi browser right kiwi browser right so you can see it here kiwi browser click on it so for iphone as i say you I, you can't see you won't see kiwi browser on your um uh, app store what you can download is yandex and hopefully it may work because i haven't tried it yet on an iphone i think um android is a go-to phone for this so i ha I have it installed already so you can install it and then just click on open when it's done install it all right so right here on kiwi browser what you have to do is to click on this three dots right here and click on desktop sites all right so now come to the search bar and type in vidiq so this was my previous search i'm going to click on it vidiq just vidiq as we did in chrome so what you have to do now as you can see the same search this is two body this is vidiq to boost your views and subscribers all right so this was the sign up field we clicked on chrome and now install chrome extension install chrome extension so click on install chrome extension all right so you click on when it shows up here you sign in with your you sign in with your um the account that you just created sign in if you have not created you can sign up from here also but i recommended that you sign in from chrome to avoid having issues so now what you have to do is to click on install chrome extension so it's going to take you to the chrome web store and as you can see i have it installed already that's why you see remove from chrome here so video key vision for youtube so if you don't have it installed just click on install here and you can have it on your phone so now what you just have to do is to right let me just walk you through the process so let me just remove it from chrome and i'm going to install it again all right so you said we are sorry to see you go so the, i'm just doing it for educational purposes so that you guys can understand how to do it so click here to restore vidiq on your phone so we say vidiq so now you can see it says add for chrome so i'm going to add it right now so it's going to check and it says add vidiq vision for youtube so click on ok and you're good to go so it's checking it's going to install very soon right it is installed so it's going to take us to another tab and it says installation was a success you have successfully installed this is okay so we are redirecting you back to youtube so it's going to take us back to youtube all right so now this was the video that is going to play i'm going to pause this right here all right so now what you have to do now is to go to youtube okay we are already in youtube and then you can sign in your youtube account on kiwi browser so sign in your account with kiwi browser on youtube and from there you have vidiq chrome extension installed on your phone so you can access all the features being offered by vidiq's free version so now let me show you what this is all right so let's head over to a video from my channel and i'm going to show you what vidiq can do so going over to videos so let's check back i think make sure that your phone is on desktop site so this is it make sure it's on desktop site that is how it's going to work efficiently all right so what we have to do now is to scroll down and let's head over to my paper video and let's see how vidiq rates it all right so you can see this is not just how the the normal layout is when we are using chrome and desktop mode you can see some added features like you can see analytics edit video supercharge your youtube channel these are the things that vidiq can offer on your phone and you can only access this normally through your laptop or maybe a desktop computer but with this trick you can access it with your phone and you can access it from anywhere so you can see it says over overview 29.6 over 100 that's poor 0 0.5 views per hour 939 views so it says which are great and you can see it says video optimization checklist title tag description card end screen as you can see all these things are the things that can help your channel 
help you when uploading a video and I'll tell you what to do. So you see my title was too long. So next time I'm going to make a short title. It says tags was good, description was good. So some people don't even know about tags. All right, so what you have to do, these are video tags. If you're creating a video and maybe you have a competitor, some people don't even understand what a competitor is. A competitor is somebody that is doing the same thing that you are doing. It could be better than you, you could be better than them, but that's your competitor is doing the same thing that you are doing. So you can be getting ideas also from them, most especially if they are better than you. And now, let me say, um, your competitor made a video concerning this and you also want to make that same video. You can just head over to your competitor's video and scroll down to the tag section. You are going to see all the tags they used and what they are ranking in and then click on copy. So this is the copy icon there. So click on this copy icon and when you click on copy, you can head over to a notepad or anywhere and paste it. Let's do that right now. So on this notepad, you're just going to click on paste. So this is these are the keywords right here. So you copy it and when you're uploading your video, when you scroll down in the in the section where you see tags, you're putting your tags there and you are good to go. So people may not even know how to put in tags, but let me show you how to put in tags. So heading over to YouTube Studio, to put in tags, you just have to, when you want to upload a video, when you create a video, upload video, or right, so when you select the file, I'm just going to select a random file, okay? So, right, so when you've selected the file that you want to upload, VIQ will help you when uploading. As you can see, as you can see, it says actionable SEO score zero over 50. So what we have to do, it says, um, get title recommendations. You see, top 10 tips for running your best marathon, a running race record with over 13,000 participants, running favorite article, this, 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 this. Right, so it can give you option that you can use for your youtube title if you don't know so upgrade to pro to see controversial keywords all right you can see this is what the pro version will offer you so the description now is it upgrade upgrade to boost to get description recommendations all right so we are not upgrading yet so you can just put anything in your description and it says see what your video and thumbnail looks like in search results so when you put in your thumbnail you can see this actually helps you to upload to get a better a better SEO ranking and to optimize your YouTube video to the to the max. So it says keyword inspector. All right, so those keywords we copy, they are just going to head as you scroll down now. This is what they call tags. So just head over to add tag and click on paste. So paste the keywords right there. As you can see, these are the keywords. These are the keywords that I copied from my main account. So you can copy your competitor's keywords and paste there if that's the same thing that they did. All right. Keywords help whenever people search on YouTube, like how to create PayPal account, they're going to see my videos. Um, if someone just types PayPal account on YouTube, they're going to see my videos. So that's the work of keywords. All right, so I think that's all, and that is how you can optimize YouTube VidIQ on your phone to make the best out of your YouTube channel. So if you got value from this YouTube video, hit the subscribe button, turn on notifications, smash that like button and share this video with your friends. Drop comment in the comment section so that people that actually want to get stuff like this, people that actually need stuff like this are going to get it and start making the best out of their YouTube channel. As you can see, the score is already improving. So when you do most of the things that they recommend for you, you are going to get an overall, a, an average VDIQ score and your video is going to rank on YouTube SEO. So that's just it for VDIQ, how to install it on your phone.